injection packers does size matter, the length of the packer is not critical for standard crack injection, a standard length will do. However, for thin wallet elements around 8 cm of concrete thickness, the length of the rubber might matter. We must ensure the rubber doesn't block the crack. The common diameters for packers for concrete crack injections are 8 or 10 mm, 3 8 inch and half inch. Humpback packers of 8, 10, 12, 14 mm, etc. represent the bar hole diameter. So for 10 mm packer we drill with a 10 mm bit. If you use inch bits, a 3 8 inch packer is for hole drilled with 3 8 inch bit. Type of injection grease nipple. The most important aspect is the tightness of the nipple. Humpback nippers are specifically designed for the injection, ensuring maximum sealing when administrating the injectant. The injectant is closer in viscosity to water than grease. The nipple perfectly holds back pressure without resin leaks during and after injection, meaning less waste, cleaner work and correctly performed injection. We have two types of nipples, conical and flat. We choose pre f pre version. The thread of this nipple underwent a machine applied coating, acting like perfectly applied Teflon tape. An ideal solution for professional injection and air venting. Once the nipple is tightened to the body, it seals, it seals instantly. Using nipples with pre pilot coating is the only way to full observe the injection process. The conical nipple is quick and cheap solution. We connect the CPX nozzle to it, push it onto the conical nipple and remove by twisting the wrist. The lifespan of such nozzle is between 500 to 300 cycles, depending on the operator's skill. Replace it after long injection breaks. Easy and quick to put in, put on and take off, even under high pressure. The downside is the nozzle with the nipple should be straight until pressure is catched. If it's not straight, it will leak. Remember, during manual pump injections, have two people, one to hold the pumps and straight to the injection packer, countering hose jerks, and one to pump. Flat nipple, CPF, CPF up nozzle. This nozzle slides onto flat nipples until resistance is fault. This connection ensures a very tight injectant administration. Slide it on and hands are free. The downside is the higher price and potential issue sliding the nozzle of the pressure over 100 bar. It means 1450 psi. The extent its lifespan lubricate with technical vaseline before each use. Over time, the sealing rubber and spring in the CPF nozzle wear out. Repair kits offer a quick and cheap fix. Installation of pre-injection packers. This method allows for injection observation and process control. Place the packer in the injection hole, ensuring all the rubber and about 1 cm of its body are inside. If the hole is excessively drilled, pinch the packers and insert. For long drills in soft materials where holes made over drill, winged packers like PSPHW 10x110 might help, or short drill 5 cm long for longer, larger diameter packers. It's best to set packers using screwdriver set of screw tightening, the quickest method. The tightening force needs verification for each new project. Often is the maximum screwdriver force on tightening. Sometimes you need to add one or one and a half wrench turns or decrease screwdriver force. Proper tightening force ensure optimal working conditions. Exclusive force can tear the rubber, making the hole unusable. Always remember the tightening force and be consistent. You can always tighten more if the packer loosens, but an over-tightened packers can't hold back high pressure.